Hi everyone and a warm welcome to Biz Talks with AT&T Business. I'm Sally Eve, CEO of Tomorrow's Tech Today, and I'm in conversation today with Sarita Rao, who is Senior Vice President of AT&T Integrated and Partner Solutions. This discussion is going to focus on the convergence of different technologies and vendors to create flexible, resilient and secure connectivity. And it starts with the network, 5G and fiber connectivity combined for a seamless and flexible experience. AT&T works with best in class channel partners to bring this ecosystem together for our business customers. Sarita, a warm welcome. Sally, thank you for having me. Oh, my absolute pleasure. So let's start from the top with a big question. Why is it 5G and fiber? How are they complementing one another? Absolutely. Well, fiber and 5G, as you know, are built uh, to work together to be more flexible and far more resilient. The goal is honestly to have a seamless experience where you don't necessarily know or be even conscious of uh, any handoffs between the two. Um, So think of it as much more of intelligent networking versus fiber and 5G, but really 5G and fiber together. So perhaps we can dive in a bit deeper as well. Now, obviously, hand in hand with more connectivity and obviously the the sparring of devices and different forms of connectivity too, we need more security and it has to be embedded by design. How are we making sure that that security piece is embedded and covered? Absolutely. So as you know, we're all responsible for security. Um, That should be top of mind for, for any CIO. But it truly starts at the network level. So we're building security into our networks, drawing on our deep expertise and experience. Um, Our security experts know business connectivity, how that works inside and out. And we're working to make sure our customers have the necessary layers of security in place um, at the core of of our network. I'd love to hear a high level overview of your organization, Sarita, and how this is operating. Absolutely. Um, So this is one of my favorite subjects. Uh, Partner Solutions Program uh, really allows for A great deal of flexibility allows our channel partners to deliver business customers uh, the best and most secure connectivity experience with our 5G and fiber. And what I love about this program is the incredible flexibility of the program. It allows our channel partners to do business the way they need to do business and how their corporation um, and their organization is structured. So they can resell, they can solo sell, they can sell with... um, you know, at and doing the billing, or they can do a joint sales strategy um, across our go-to-market program. So what we've really tried to offer is a great deal of flexibility for our channel partners because we know buying behavior is changing. So we want to make sure that we meet that buyer where they are and uh, hence believing that we need to offer utmost flexibility to our channel partners approach is so, so important and personalizing that, making it flexible, as you say. I think it also just feeds into a wider theme. I think it's just so powerful at the moment and resonates so strongly about that power of the ecosystem, that collective and coming together. And I think the way you're supporting that with the program, I think it's fantastic to see and really, really just embeds that real need and necessity today. And you mentioned there about go-to-market. Can you explain more for the viewers about what the go-to-market program is all about? Absolutely. So we believe it's important to create real business value. And as you heard me just say, we believe buyer behavior has changed. CIOs are going to different companies across a much broader ecosystem. And our goal, again, is to provide secure connectivity, whether it be in the 5G or fiber space or really truly in a hybrid space. So in our go-to-market program, we work with every every um, kind of flavor, as I'll call it, from hyperscalers, to systems integrators, um, to uh, advisory firms. But also in the core of what we do is we work with our solution providers and our MSPs across the business. So whether you're a small or mid-sized customer or a large enterprise customer, we've truly built a go-to-market program that can focus on that core connectivity and how we bring that to you in everything you do in a very coordinated approach um, so we can complement the larger solution. As you know, connectivity is a critical piece. Um, Pretty much every solution requires that connectivity, but we know that there's a broader ecosystem that we need to work through uh, to provide an end-to-end solution. I love that. So it's connectivity across all, so applications, platforms, devices, et cetera. But I love the fact there is you mentioned different types of organizations as well, you know, from SMB to enterprise, for example. And I think that's so important, particularly when we're looking at security, but obviously other forms of support and facilitation too. Now it has to be for organizations of any size, doesn't it? So I love the fact you brought that to the fore as well. Really is an ecosystem approach, isn't it? In, in, in a really actualized, brilliant. It, it definitely needs to be, right? Whether you're a small business or or a large 
global enterprise connectivity is core in every everything that you need. So that's why we thought it was really important to build that flexibility in and partner across a broad system. You know, customers are are looking for something very reliable, highly secure. Um, connectivity. So they no longer care, right? This is kind of that ultimate goal of how that service is being delivered. So we're in the process of launching uh, AT&T Wireless Broadband and Wireless Broadband, uh, giving our partners another capability to provide network access to their customers. So that's just one more tool in their tool chest. Um, and again, really leveraging sort of that mobile and uh, wired network um, and being able to give customers that seamless connectivity. So also, what's next from an AT&T partner solution perspective? I'd love to hear more about what you're exploring right now. Um, this is an incredible area of investment uh, for AT&T. We're on a multi-year uh, roadmap, continuously focused on making um, the experience easier for our partners. And if the experience is easier for our partners, that means it's going to be easier for our joint customers. So uh, everything from being far more API enabled, uh, from offering a streamlined uh, set of products and capabilities, and then um, being able to offer both um, in the wireline world as well as the mobility world. So offering services across uh, both of those. So that's really where we've been truly focused. Um, it's always been about choice and flexibility, but I do believe the one thing that truly separates us from, from all others is the incredible investment we're making in our network. As you know, uh, at at and we're extremely focused on our core. Um, so the investment we're making, the infrastructure is second to none, and that's just going to continue to grow, and that's going to enable our partners to reach more customers um, on a daily basis. And that's where you'll see our investments, everything from the platform and um, the API structure up through and including an incredible investment in our network. I love that. That's fantastic. I think you're hitting you know, key challenges right on the head and you know, converting them to opportunities, frankly, in terms of you know, reducing complexity, that personalized experience, security baked in by design, that friction free we've spoken about a lot today as mm -hmm. well. But also beyond that as well, not just investment in the network um, from the security perspective, also things around sustainability and frankly, investment in the community more broadly as well. I've really appreciated your efforts in that area, too. So I wanted to mention that, too, because when we talk about the power of the ecosystem, that giving back is is so, so important, too, isn't it? Absolutely. I, I think that's, um, frankly, um, within our culture. Um, and it's an incredible focus for us um, and, and truly an area that we continue to build expertise in. Fantastic. I love that. And so much more to come as well. Honestly, it's been amazing speaking to you, Sarita. It's been a fantastic biz talk. I can't wait to the next one in the series too and to chat again soon. So much to share with the audience. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Thanks again for your time. I know the calendar is a bit crazy, so truly appreciate it. Thanks so much for joining us. This has been Biz Talks with AT&T Business. Thanks for watching. For more videos from AT&T Business, click subscribe. Thank you.